What is going on everybody? It is Ranger Marcus or Marcus Raymond. Today we are road cruising for amphibians. So I'm at the same place I was a couple days ago, but we are road cruising for the amphibians instead of just looking for them. So I've done this kind of thing before, but with snakes. So road cruising is just another form of herping. While you drive along the road, hopefully there are amphibians on the road while it's raining outside like it is tonight. Now I've never done this before for frogs and salamanders, but today we're gonna give it a shot. Before we do that, I'm gonna go back a couple days because I found my first two snakes of Oregon already. So let me show you these couple clips and then we'll get back to the video. All right guys, so it's gonna be a little bit hard to hear me, but I got my first snake of Oregon shaking his head there, acting like he's some arboreal snake, which he's not. But I flipped him under a little board. This is a Northwestern garter snake. He's got some funky going on there on his skin and his scales, but this is a Northwestern garter snake. My first snake of Oregon. Look at him shaking his head like that. It's kind of funny. Rough green snakes do that on the East Coast, but I've never seen a garter snake do that. So maybe these guys like to go up in trees or something. Nice find though. Look at that, it's so weird. He may have something going on with him, I don't know. It's kind of acting a little strange. You can kind of see he's got something up with his mouth there. So I'm going to sanitize after I hold this snake and put him back. Because I'm not really sure what is going on with this guy. Cool find though. First snake in Oregon. Let's keep herping. All right, I just got my pictures of this guy. Let's put him back. Nobody go back under your board. There you go. There he goes. I smell like musk, so I'm going to sanitize. Now under the rock over was this, I guess, yellow belly racer, but it's got a white and blue belly there. Two snakes now after I didn't see any salamanders. So I got this yellow belly racer and then the Northwestern garter snake. So first two snakes of Oregon. Well, I'm not gonna get any pictures of this guy just cause I'm kind of running out of time here, but uh, I'll put this guy go. Back under his rock there. Nice, two snakes. All right, back to road cruising. Here we have another torrent salamander. Cool guy here. Here is another little torrent salamander here in the water. Now, as I was looking at this one, got another one right there. Here's our second torrent salamander of the night. Little cute guy. And right next to it, I didn't even see this coastal giant salamander. About three, four inches or so. These guys can get to about a foot long at full length. This is a little larval stage coming out here in the water. Pretty cool. So it's getting really difficult to see anything on the road just because it's so foggy up here. So I think I'm gonna change locations and see if we can road crew somewhere else. It's still raining pretty hard, but I think we're gonna go change locations and go look for salamanders and frogs there. Okay, I think we just found the first salamander. Oh my God. This is a mammoth California, not California, sorry. Coastal giant salamander. Holy crap, this dude is big. It's at least like eight, nine inches. Holy crap. That's a big boy right there. Look at this guy. Oh, that makes me so happy. This is a huge coastal giant salamander. Right here on the road right here on the road so sick he's kind of starting to notice that i'm here taking pictures of him he's starting to back up a little bit i want to move this guy off the road and keep herping this this really helps i was starting to lose hope and i was going to go to a different location but now i kind of want to keep going on this road because this is exactly what i came here for a huge coastal giant salamander 
And look at the cool patterning on the back. These guys are awesome. Look at that, man. That is so sick. All right, I'm gonna pick this guy up and move him across the road to the side he was going. Yeah. Yup. What a chonker. All right. Moving this guy on the other side of the road where there is a huge little waterfall here. Moving him this way. So he can be on his merry way. <laughs> Look at that guy. So slimy. Big old giant salamander. All right, dude. Peace. As I was walking back to the car, after I just put the giant salamander down, I see this frog. This must be a Pacific tree frog. Very nice. Move this guy off the road too. All right, moving this guy off the road here. So I've changed locations, brand new location. And uh, I'm kind of like at a state park kind of thing. And it says it closes at 10 and it's like 10.30, but I'm sure nobody will mind. But yeah, uh, we got the, uh, the first herp at this new spot already. It's been like two minutes. We have a rough skin newt. This is exactly what I was looking for. I think I'm gonna see a couple of these guys. Uh, we're not really on a road, we're just on a path here. So uh, I think we're gonna see a couple of these and we don't really have to move them off the road. We move them off this path here. So I'm just gonna let this guy go and keep walking. And here's our second herp of the new location, another little Pacific tree frog. Cute little green guy. Nice. All right, second little rough skin newt next to a big old worm. It honestly could eat it. I'm fairly sure that uh, newts eat worms. I could totally be wrong, but look at him. He's going right after it. Do it. Eat it. Maybe not. Maybe he's just walking. Nice. Second new of the night. I'm walking back to the car now, so this is probably going to be the last herp of the night. Rough skin new. So I found two pretty good places to go look for herps at night. Awesome. All right, guys, that is going to do it for me here in Oregon. My third video here. You saw a ton of stuff in this video. You saw two snakes in the beginning. You saw some torrent salamanders, that huge giant salamander. Found some newts here, and we got some Pacific tree frogs. Thanks for watching though. Like and subscribe. Peace.